Assalamu alaikum and good evening all of you. Before starting anything, I would like to share a famous spiritual quote which I always use to amplify my abilities. It goes like Imam Ali Raza quote from his father Imam Musa Qasim. He quote from his father Imam Jafar Sadiq. He quote from his father Imam Muhammad Bakir. He quote from his father Imam Zainul Abidin. He quote from his father Imam Hussain. He quote from his father Mala Ali. He quote from the Holy Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam. And he said, "What faith is? Faith is knowing from your heart, expressing it through your tongue, and performing it with your organs. So whatever you do in life, faith is the basic necessity for everything." So starting with the estrogen synthesis, the estrogen synthesis starts with the endosterine dione. Endosterine dione is the starting material for the estrogen synthesis, and aromatization is performed on the endosterine dione by the help of an enzyme aromatase. That is, the first cycle, that is the A cycle, will be aromatized. That is, alternate single double bond formation will occur on the A A ring. As a result of aromatization, single double bond formation, the double bond of oxygen cannot remain stable because this carbon will be forming a double bond. So the oxygen carbon cannot make five valencies. So in order to perform aromatization, the double bond between the carbon and oxygen is cleaved, and oxygen again cannot. remain stable with a single uh, bond with carbon so it will attach hydrogen to itself so it will appear in the form of a hydroxyl group and further the aromatization is appeared in the form of this so uh, after aromatization the endosterine dione is converted into estrone which is also known as e1 and an active form of estro estrogen so the next step is the formation of estrogen from testosterone which is estradiol also known as e2 which is another important form of estrogen the one we have discussed e1 and this is now e2 so again the aromatization of testosterone on the a cycle will cause the oxygen to remove the bond double bond from the carbon and oxygen will attain an hydrogen to keep itself stable so aromatization of testosterone simply this aromatization is performed and the double bonded oxygen is converted into hydroxyl as a result of this aromatization so after the the aromatization of testosterone produced estradiol which represents that diol represents two alcoholic group that are oh group who uh two alcoholic groups are present that's why it is known as estradiol so this was all about the estrogen synthesis